I was a camper at Camp Hawthorne. My children were campers at Camp Sabra, and my grandchildren all went to Camp Sabra. And every time I took a child to camp, I thought, what a wonderful experience. They are about to share just exactly what I shared when I was a young child. The first time I went to camp, I was nine years old. My parents were, didn't even really ask me, just kind of shipped me off with one of my best friends and said, we'll see you in a month. <laughs> My whole family went here, and they had such an amazing time that I wanted to try it. I always wanted to go from the time I, w I could remember. I've been involved with Camp Sabra for 42 and a half years, my entire life. Except for the pool, it's really very much the same buildings as when I was a camper in the 70s. There's a lot of things that we could do to improve the facilities. I feel like Sabra is, is ours to take care of for the next generation. Camp Sabra is just part of our life. It's just a part of who we are as a family. I think that the outdoor part was my, definitely my favorite. When I was at camp, we did all of our swimming at the lake and it was so amazing. My mom talks about camp and all her memories and how fun it was when she was here and it's exactly the same. It's so much fun. I don't know what I would do without it. It makes me so proud and so happy that we still have this facility and we still have Sabra for her to be able to experience what I've experienced and that it's still going strong. I'm gonna have so many memories when I'm older. I try new things, in large part because of my experiences growing up at Sabra. I think I tried everything. Sometimes once, and then some things I just kept doing. <laughs> I still fish all the time. It stays with you for life. So I cast my line out near the middle and then I got like a big tug and everybody thought it was a rock. Announcements, announcements, announcements. Jake Palmer caught an 18 inch catfish. I think I just got the big dad. Camp Cyber is an amazing place. It teaches you community and citizenship and it teaches you family. It teaches you religion and it does that in the right way I think. When I think about camp, I think about Shabbat at camp. There just really is something incredible about looking over the Lake of the Ozarks and, and celebrating Shabbat. Children participate in the services. Never want to go home. Inside jokes have a lot of They're inventing things, and they might cite the Torah portion and then talk about camp and then say a prayer that they've created while overlooking this beautiful land setting overlooking the lake. We are and we like to say hello. Hi. I think about everyone just getting around and cheering and singing and being and so proud to be Jewish and, and expressing that. Um, in a way that you can't express anywhere else because everyone feels that same pride. I still have dreams about camp all the time. You never not think about camp. All year it was all about my camp friends and camp and you know I couldn't wait to get back there. That's all she talks about all school year long until When's camp? How many more days? The countdown till camp. I will carry this camp experience with me forever. Sabra stays with you forever. Forever and ever. <laughs> forever.
forever. Definitely. I really want Camp Sauber to go on forever and ever because my kids need to have the same experience as I did because it's such an amazing place here. Those feelings go on and, and they don't change when you get older. They get stronger and they start at Sabra.